So what's up guys? Welcome back. We are going to be watching Dr. Stone episode 13. So last week's episode ended off really well. This three-man tag team was able to get the acid with the major help of Ginro last minute, you know. And now it seems like they have something very, very crucial to what they need in order to make the medication for the sister. So without further ado, let's just jump right into the episode and see whatever other goodness they have to offer. Let's go! Oh, hi, yo. <laughs> it kills me every time, I swear. It kills me inside. And it was like, oh, hi. Good morning. <laughs> I saw so many references of that in anime, honestly. Sodium hydroxide. What the hell? This is developing way too fast. What the hell? Look at Seiko! Oh, she's trying to use that. Oh, look at her face. Kinro has got this, but he needs glasses. He needs the glasses that stay on your head type glasses. My name is Turquoise? I did not know this this whole time. <laughs> That's cool. Look at this dude's face. Is that so he can enter the village? We all know he's gonna enter that ring and just fall to his knees without even getting hit. Like, oh, I lost, my bad, but at least he got in. <laughs> See? But that's what I said last week! Last week, I oh my god, I said that's how they should let my boy Chrome marry his girl. Okay, that's literally what I said last week. I'm like, they just gotta, they gotta fake it, you know? They gotta exactly. <laughs> He's like, damn it! <laughs> Are they licking him? She wants to, yes, she wants to save her sister. This is, like, bro, like, yeah. This is a vibe, of course. I feel like this show tends to make scenes dramatic when it's like uncalled for, like it's weird, it doesn't like fit right. 
Like that scene was just based on the comedy and they just had it like all serious all of a sudden. For real? Hey, I love that picture. That's poster worthy. I'm trying to have that. I love how Senku's just making it through. Like, what a boss man. Like, he's just making it around. He's just making it. He's in the stories. She's heard stories with his name. Girl! What? I thought they were from the past, but maybe they're from the future? What is his last name? I'm not sure. Oh, because the concept. They don't even know the concept of last names? She's the same one that knew about the thing, you should know this. <laughs> this dude just came through. <laughs> hey, Kimono was like, oh, that's not. I thought that was Kino. That's Chrome. That shield was him hitting this dude's wee wee. Why are you yelling that? Don't yell that, my dude. Okay, so wait. Kinro has to go up against Magma last? Oh, hold on. I get it now. I'm so dumb. I get it now. There's like two sections fighting. There's one. That's why they couldn't do that with Chrome because Chrome would probably end up ending against. No! That's not true because let's say Chrome was on. No. Yeah. Let's say Chrome and all the others were on this side. Like Chrome, Kinro, Kinro, whatever it is. And Chrome makes. They make him get to the top. Then Kohaku would take this side, she would destroy everybody, including Magma, Magma. And then it would be Ma it would be Kohaku and Chrome left, right? Something like that. I feel like that would be possible. And then she would fake her defeat and then Chrome gets his girl. And they, they can't decide. It's like a it's just they don't have yeah, so never mind. I guess it's not gonna work that way. Yo, that's so dumb and that's so bad. That's freaking bad. Aww. Who the hell? <sighs> he just had glasses. Like, I'm so upset. Oh, it's Kohaku against Senku? Look at your dumbass 
those things. Okay, see, this is why you don't just eat the damn leaves, Ginero. What? Like, kick him off the bridge! So just because he told you that, you're freaking out. Some people will just tell you things and you're just gonna act on it just because they brought it up. Like, of course, the, the possibility of her drowning was always there. You just didn't think of it. So the moment someone tells you, that's when you're gonna like, oh, let me act on it. <laughs> Next time, don't eat the leaves, Ginro. <laughs> but he can't even see your shoes. <laughs> Check his arms, fam. Oh! There's dice. Hell to the nah. Okay, but he should be banished. Like, what is this? Wait, what? Wait, what? Hold on. What did I miss here? Nothing. <laughs> I don't get it. What does that mean? I actually don't get it. What? Of course not, because Carl could never give him a chance. Yo, that's some really fuzzy eyes. If he had glasses, he could probably own. <gasps> She's gonna notice. Watch the prescription match, bro. Oh, he didn't hit him. Oh, shit. Oh, no. <gasps> Can they please have the same prescription so that she could just, like, throw her helmet on his head? And then kill two birds with one stone. She's gonna expose her face for like the first time to everyone, and he's gonna see you for like the first time. Yo, let's do this. Come on. Can y'all just have the same prescription, please? But she's like a little superhero. Like, low key, she's just like awesome. What if it's not his prescription though, it would not help. Like what if he's not, like what was she? She was uh, nearsighted or farsighted? Rangers, if you know what I mean. <laughs> he powered up. Hey! <laughs> oh, look at her! I actually want him to have one like that now. It's funny, I want Sika to take it off and I want him to put it on. <laughs> Oh my god. 
Yo, why does he actually look cool? <laughs> In like the weirdest way. What? 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 Oh my gosh, I cannot believe it ended like that. Jeez, it goes by so fast when I'm enjoying something. Like, I'm so happy. I'm so happy his freaking eye issue has been exposed and now you can finally see again um, and get his own pair of glasses and be able to see in the future. It's and that was just great. That was just like I didn't think of anything proceeding this way and I'm just really happy it did because it just surprised me and I love getting surprised um, in a good way. So now with that being said, Kino already beat magma and it seems like magma was the biggest force and now honestly with that helmet he's unstoppable okay um like i wonder if he's even stronger than kohakuna probably not she's a gorilla no nah, but maybe he is so just whatever like it, didn't he win technically already like just he should have gone up against freaking chrome now damn it's too late because they have to sign in but if he went against chrome he would just let himself get defeated and Chrome would like win and get his girl, bro. Like, I'm mad. Uh, I really want Chrome to like be with her. I don't like this whole like arranged marriage thing. Like, this is not cool. But more than anything, I want her to get helped. I want to know more about what she knows. I don't get her. Like, how does she know these things of either the past or the future? You know what I mean? Like, how does she know these things? Um, and why is she the only one? Like, she has a sister, she has a father, and they don't seem to understand like she does, so... What's going on here? So with all that being said, I'm super excited to see what next week's episode has to offer, um, and what it's gonna do, how it's gonna develop from there. I'm sure we're gonna get into the medication, finally. Um, and hopefully we're gonna see, um, Senku talking with, you know. But yep, I am looking forward to next week. So thanks a lot guys for watching. Leave comments down below how you guys feel. No spoilers, please. And I'll be seeing y'all again tomorrow for the last episode of Demon Slayer Kimetsu no Yaiba. This is going to be a very sad, exciting finale, I think. Um, it's gonna be a sad farewell. But it's gonna be, I'm sure, pretty exciting and probably really frustrating too if there's gonna be a major cliffhanger. So I'll see you guys tomorrow. Thanks a lot again for watching and bye!